morning backyard buddies welcome to backyard nature adventures i'm beth and it is thursday may 14th i don't think the weather can decide what it wants to do today it's been sunny it's been rainy it's been cloudy it's been clear it's been windy what a crazy day in ohio now we've been talking all about rocks. Rocks are so much fun to play with in your backyard. And today I thought I would share with you some ideas for things that you can do with rocks. Now for our younger backyard buddies. What about finding a bunch of rocks? and lining them up in order from smallest rocks to largest rocks. Or how about organizing them by size? So you've got all your tiny rocks and your small rocks and your medium-sized rocks and your large big rocks all organized in groups or you could actually sort them by color how about this i've got one circle that has dark gray rocks in it one circle with light gray rocks, one circle with tan rocks in it, and one circle that looks like it has white rocks in it. So there's all kinds of ways to sort your rocks. You could make two groups even, those that are rough, and the other group would be the ones that are smooth. It's up to you how you want to organize all your rocks. Now, what about using some rocks to set up an obstacle course? You could run around the rocks. You could hop around the rocks. You could ride your bike around the rocks. You could do whatever you would like. What do you say we run around the rocks? Are you ready? Here we go. Whoa, whoa, we're going, we're going, we're going, we're going fast. Go fast, fast, go fast, fast, fast. Oh, my goodness, my goodness, my goodness. Oh, we did it. And you could go back the other way doing something different if you would like. Now, for the older backyard buddies. What about hopscotch? If you don't know how to play hopscotch, you better have a big person teach you because it's a great, fun game. I've got a rock down here as my marker. And you start out by tossing the rock onto the number one square. Oops, it didn't even make it. So I would lose my turn. Let's try that again. There we go. And then whatever square the rock is in, you cannot step on it. And you have to hop from box to box. If there are two boxes together like the two and three, you can put both of your feet down. If it's just one box, you have to go on one foot. All right, my rock's in. Box number one, I've got to jump over that to the two and the three. Whoop! There we go, there's my feet. And now one foot onto the four. There it is. And two feet onto the five and the six. And one foot and two feet. And then up to the ten. And then you have to jump and turn around. Whoop! And go all the way back again, two feet. One feet, two feet, one feet, two feet. And when you get to number one, you have to lean down, pick up your rock, and then jump all the way over that box and not land on it. All right. 
That sure would be great fun to play today. And of course, you can't have a lot of rocks without trying to build the tallest tower you can with as many rocks as you can. How fun. And you also can't have a lot of rocks without building some buildings or bridges or towers or a whole village. Look, I'm down at the base of Betty, our beautiful beech tree, and I built this really cool house. I've actually got some flat rocks out front. That's the road. And I put little teeny tiny rocks from the house out to the road. That's the little sidewalk. And my house actually has two stories to it. That's a pretty cool house, isn't it? All right, backyard buddies. All kinds of fun things to do today with rocks. Get outside and play at least 20 minutes. See what kinds of games and activities you can create with your rocks. Make sure you make today a good day to play outside. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye!